אמי כהן, שפונדה צוות שייז האב, אימיגרטד מיוניטד סטייטס לישראל. The big guy approached me in the corridor and he goes, Hey, good morning, how are you? Listen, I'd like to bring a few kids from Ethiopia for heart surgery. What do you think about it? I, I looked at him and said, uh, This is a crazy idea. We have no setup. As we started, I understood the meaning of this program that is much, much bigger than anything I, I did before. So we brought two kids, operated on them, sent them back home, then brought two more. And when they're coming to Israel, they have to stay somewhere. And they, Ami decided that uh, they will be at his home before the surgery and after the surgery. I think that was something that uh, really shocked everybody. Personally, it meant a lot of hard work. Professionally, it was amazing. It was like a message for all of us that uh, medicine can be different. By the end of the year, it was a very interesting year. We had operated on more than 30 kids from Ethiopia. So we created an organization, gave it a name, Save a Child's Heart. And as they said, the rest is history. If you didn't have a man uh, like Ami Cohen with a vision, with a dream, and with the ability to fulfill this dream, that would never happen. He was up to conquer off all the challenges. One of them was a dream to uh, climb the Kilimanjaro uh, and to reach the summit. I still remember I was standing in the unit when uh, Dawn, his secretary, walked in crying, said, Ami died. We, we felt devastated. And it became clear to us that no matter what, we cannot let this organization die. We survived it, uh, I think, thanks to Professor Schachner. He knew that he needed to take everybody together and, and continue. And on Ami's grave, we all make a vow that we will keep his legacy. It touches me to see children that uh, are going to die and uh, we succeed to save them. Years after, when you uh, meet the family again and you see the mother and the child that was very small, now is, is, is a big child, and you see that we all made something, we made a difference. Just last month I was in Ethiopia and I met quite a few kids that we operated on in the beginning. One is a lawyer learning for our maid. The other one is running an orphanage. He was an orphan himself when we met him. For me, Save a Child's Heart is the opportunity to treat children from all the world equally. It's a real unbelievable thing that uh, we are able uh, to make a difference in this world. We started the uh, a Palestinian clinic here uh, on Tuesdays, for 20 years Tuesdays. And uh, the first was uh, me and my mother. My mother was doing the files. She stopped working and came to volunteer here. It's just amazing. It's beautiful it's to be able to help kids from all over the world, no matter what their race is, no matter what their color is. To give life to a child and now he's uh, 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 living uh, uh, normally, this is a feeling that I, I think it's beyond description in, in, in words. Save a Child's Heart for me, it's like a miracle. We are celebrating more than 20 years of activities. We are celebrating more than 4,700 kids from 57 different countries and we are celebrating uh, us being recognized by the UN. We try to, to teach many, many physicians from all over the world how to treat children with heart disease, not only professionally, but also emotionally. For the next generation that with the lead of a child's heart, my advice is to keep the teamwork. 
uh, to work in harmony. For me, Save a Child's Heart is a life changer. The take home message is that if you really have a passion to something, you can achieve it.